So service support at LibreServe is also very important. Uh, and to that end, we've produced an iPhone app. We have sites that we have people permanently based on site, managing, controlling people's metalworking fluids. We have uh, service engineers visiting accounts weekly, monthly, controlling people's fluids. Um, but I want to talk a little bit more about the new iPhone app we, we've launched, 2017, which is designed to help customers monitor and control their cutting fluids. Very simple to use. First thing you need to do is set up a department, put in department name, then you can add a machine shop, add the machines. So obviously on this we're already added. Very simple and quick to set up. When you're doing your coolant checks, simply go into the coolant check icon, select your department, machine shop one, select the machine, a Hasby F2 in this case, then select your date, so 11th of Jan today. Now the refractometer reading, this automatically calculates uh, the bricks factor, so we can directly take the refractometer reading, let's say 5 in this case, then you'll check your pH to see uh, the alkalinity of the fluid. So let's say 9 today. These are optional if you, if you want to record your tramp oil level. If you've made any additions to the fluid, some antifoam maybe or some conditioner. And you can even record if you've topped up. So we press save. Update it successfully. Move on to the next machine. So the next one in the machine shop. Run through the same again. So very, very quick to use and store all your information. When you want to interrogate that information, we go to history. We can select machine shop one again. Then you get the option here. You can either graph or you can export the data, which will send this as a, a CSV file. So let's just have a look at the graph. If we want to choose a machine, we can show the graph for that. So this is concentration indicating your upper and lower level. So you can very easily see if it's gone out of specification. The same here if you want to have a look at uh, the historical pH readings. Again, we can scroll through this, all printable. If you wanted to go through, export the whole of the machine shop, so all the machines on it, simply select the machine shop, export data, set if you wanted this for the last year, click export data, and that will send a file to either LubriServe or you can send that to yourself. There's also uh, a nice little feature in here, a reference section which is a LubriServe guide to metalworking fluids. So this is really quite a comprehensive guide um, and it, it'll help you troubleshoot, understand all the terminology, the theory behind these, how cutting fluids work, how to clean systems, health and safety concerns, troubleshooting, maintenance of fluid mixing, so very, very comprehensive. So that should help with any questions that uh, customers might have along the way. Um, as we mentioned, if you export the data, this will send a CSV file. We can load this directly into our fluid management software uh, from which we can generate uh, graphs, very detailed graphs, all the additions that have been made and all the historical data of that in a PDF report, which uh, is great for the HSE so they can see actively that you have been controlling and monitoring your fluids. So everything should be in order, nicely recorded.